Rubbish! Bought a frisbee. I had a frisbee for ages. Are we ready? Life frisbee. Morning! Welcome to another vlog from the Yorkshire Dad. Today's Sunday. We're going to the beach. It's not warm enough, but we're going to go anyway. Make a day of it. I think it's probably going to be filey. And uh, let's see what today brings. But right now, I've got marmalade toast to eat and a lovely brew made by Helen. And Helen. It's quarter to ten. We still haven't left the house for the beach. Helen's feeling a bit iffy. The girls are all on a bit of a go slow. And we're just not getting anywhere near the car very quickly. Hooray! Hooray! We've reconfigured the car. The two little ones are at the back. So no dogs with us today. Where are we going? Filey. Filey. Filey, we're off to Filey. Filey. So off we go. At Filey. And uh, the car parking machines are on the blink. It was a bit of a lottery as to whether it would take the coins or not. So it's just taken me a good 15, 20 minutes to queue up and then get a ticket for the parking. Oh, what an experience. Right, let's go girls. And I can see the sea. Finally it's busy. Yes, Helen needs a wee. So we're getting the speed on down to the toilets somewhere. Just here on the Right. And down there is the sea! We can see the sea! I've forgotten my shades. The ones on my head are my spares and they're a bit battered. So I'm looking for some cheap shades because I only buy cheap ones. So uh, let's see what suits me. I think I'll go to Primark. I'm not paying a fiver for cheap sunglasses. They are cheap at a fiver. And they're no better than what you get at Primark for a quid. So I'm not bothering you. Tight yorks for that. I tell the time by my tummy. My tummy tells me it's lunchtime. So let's go see what this uh, place does for us. Oh, that's the fish and chips. That smells like fish and chips to me. I'm struggling to understand the pricing structure. You better leave us to it. Chip shop. When Helen works here. A really good fish and chip shop. A really good one. It's really particular. She's just grilled the waitress as to how their chips are cooked. They're not frozen, are they? No. It wouldn't have hurt the waitress to smile. I could have asked what potato she's using. Service with a grunt. Deary me. I'm having fish and chips and uh, we're all having something different. Grace is just squeezing in under the radar for a children's meal. A bit strict. So uh, let's see how the food turns out. I even think it's cheap tea. Helen's got issues with the quality of the sugar. It's you can't see mummy. And um, the, tea. the tea. I haven't tried my tea yet, so uh, I'll let you know in a minute. And 
the man has been a bit grumpy and she because she stayed up last night and organised all her teddy bears in bed instead of going to sleep, didn't she, Lila? Yeah, I yeah. stayed up. So she's a bit grumpy this morning. Not to worry, this afternoon really, as well, after lunch. Mm, that's delicious, thank you. I ordered a whale for an old tea test. Um, you got a whale, Daddy? Mm. Fish and chips are nice, a cup of tea with crap. And now we're going to get buckets and spades! And go out down onto the beach, just as the tide's coming in. So, uh, to invest in some buckets and spades because Duke, Duke's running out. Duke likes buckets and spades. So uh, let's go buy some things. Rubbish! Bought a frisbee. I've had a frisbee for ages. Are we ready? Live frisbee. Oh, I haven't lost it. Not lost it. Come on, Lid. I'm over there, I was over there! Here we go again. On a roll. It's all in the wrist action. Oh, that wasn't so good. That wasn't as good. Rubbish! Here we are again. Getting better. Getting better. Whoa. Here we go, here we go. Rubbish! Oh! Look at this! Professionals! Oh! <laughs> Learn to catch! Hi. Hi. They could have probably gone in the sea. It's not cold, but it's not really warm. But they could have gone in the sea in their wetsuits, but never mind. They're having plenty of fun there. Burying feet in sand. That is really fun. Playing, building sand castles and water slides and playing frisbee. Yeah, really nice. Quite a lot of people packed into a small space now though because the tide's come in. It's about the only place in Thailand that the tide doesn't come in. Uh, a bit busy, not a lot of room, so we just had to give up on Frisbee. Too many near misses. Especially with Grace's loose arm, hey Grace? I will just come back with four ice creams for the girls and now I really want an ice cream. They're all eating ice creams. Ice creams all around me. I want an ice cream. I want an ice cream. We'll get one on the way back to the car I think. Right, it's time to head home. It's that always the hard bit, getting the sand off the feet. And the feet in the shoes. But I didn't take mine off. <laughs> They did. We we're going to have to get them in the shoes. Right, time to go. Oh, it's always nice, isn't it? We could have gone down there. Yeah, well, the tide's just going out now. It's like an old fashioned seaside town, is Filey. Nice and simple. Anyway, time to get an ice cream, walk back to the car, and get home and see how the dogs are doing. So. Let's get going. It's his and hers ice cream time. Mm. Do you? Oh no, it's not ours. Oh, very nice ice cream. Just got to get back to the car. And then the small matter of a little drive home. Got to call at Lidl first. Yes, thank you. 
<sighs> Let's get going. Home. Why are the journeys home always harder than the journeys there? Oh, the girls just were on it all the way home. Anyway, we're home. The dogs are fine. The girls are in the shower. And I'm going to make lasagna for tea. It's been a nice day. A bit tired now. It's that sea air. It's always that sea air, isn't it? Sea air. Sea air. Anyway, lasagna. So I'm going to go for a quick run. Don't often go for a quick run at tea time. But I've got to try and grab half an hour here and there where I can. Oh, that were a quick, quick run. Not quite five kilometres, but... Oh, I went up that steep bank. I'll be out my arse by the time I got to the top, but yeah, a good enjoyable run. You know it's been good when uh, you're sweating really, really hard. And you're still sweating once you've had a shower. So I'm going to have to have another shower. But now it's time to get some scram down. Lasagna time. It's DIY time. Really should be the bedtime for the little ones, but I really need to sort these drawers out. They're getting on my nerves now, so I'm going to do a bit of a, a bit of DIY just to calm me down a bit. Because being a parent sometimes is bloody hard work, especially when you've got a 12-year-old coming up to a 13-year-old who tests you. Never stop loving her, but right now she is testing. But I'm sure I was the same when I was 12, turning 13. Maybe, not quite as bad. I was a good boy. That's my mum. Is that right? Here it goes. Didn't charge the drill properly. No DIY. Silly boy. Oh well, I'll go and have a cup of tea instead. So it turned out all that it really needed in then in the first place was the uh, fixings tightening up, and that was me thinking that the drawers were falling apart. So. Quite happy. No DIY required. Just a trusty screwdriver. Nothing else to fix now. Cup of tea. Bum on sofa. And I've got a vlog of Casey Neistat to watch. If you've not watched his vlog, watch it. Because his style is kind of influencing my style. But I don't live in New York. And I'm not currently on a road trip across America. But hey, I live in Kirby Moorside. So thanks for watching. We're now watching a bit of Pulp Fiction. They're in the uh, the burger joint. Reminds me of that place at Meadowall. Yeah. Like it there, where they dance on the table. You can take the girls. Yeah, we'll have to take the girls. Anyway, and thank. Clone. Pardon. And a bank loan. And a bank loan. Yeah, and a bank loan. So that's it for today. Hope you've enjoyed watching. Please subscribe, click like, do all that, share it. Thank you very much. See you again.